Hey everybody, what's going on? I am Greg Sussman, joined today by Tom Vecchio of FanDuel, who's here to go over the top stars on the board tonight in the NBA if you're playing DFS. What's going on, Tom? I'm doing good. You know, a few more games before the All-Star break. We got a solid slate to start the week. Let's go. Let's begin with the Brooklyn Nets, specifically with Kyrie Irving. No Kevin Durant once again tonight. Kyrie is $9,000 for Brooklyn, whose winning streak ended, but that doesn't mean Kyrie's not going to go off tonight. Exactly. And, you know, the Nets didn't have Kyrie in that game. It was kind of the James Harden show. But tonight, looking like a great spot. He's off of the injury report. He should be good to go. Coming in with a 33% usage rate with the current starting lineup for the Nets, producing 1.22 FanDuel points per minute. We have a very solid 234 point over under going up against the Spurs. And we see both teams in the top 12 when it comes to the pace. The Spurs, you know, they might be surging right now, but they're still struggling on defense, allowing 50.69 fainted points per game to opposing point guards. That's the second worst in the league. Kyrie's back. He's healthy. Great game environment. He's a lock tonight. Kyrie, you have to get in there. As you said, took that game off. It was the James Harden show. Now Kyrie's back. He's healthy. He's fresh. And, and that's the important thing for this Nets team going off against San Antonio, which, as you mentioned, the pace isn't exactly uh, the, the greatest in the NBA, but Kyrie should be in a good spot here tonight at $9,000. Up next, the best team in the NBA, that's the Utah Jazz. And they're led by Donovan Mitchell, the Utah Jazz star. He's $8,300 tonight, a price that still seems low for as good as Mitchell is. Exactly. 8300 I want to say, is pretty affordable. He leads the Jazz with a 31.1% usage rate. But more importantly, this game is extremely, extremely lopsided in one specific category. That is three-pointers. The Jazz lead the league this season with 16.9 made three-pointers as a team per game. We've all seen these records that they're having 15 plus three pointers in X amount of games, setting all these records. Now they're going up against the Pelicans who are dead last in the league when it comes to three pointers allowed per game sitting at 15.8. We have two teams at the literal opposite ends of the spectrum when it comes to three pointers. So the scoring upside is immense here. That's why we see a 236 point over under. So I am looking to Donovan Mitchell very confidently tonight. I think you can always be confident with Donovan Mitchell. And in this game where this spot, he makes a, a ton of sense. And it always does. Yeah, fairly priced at under 9000 here at $8,300. Donovan Mitchell for the Jazz should be in your FanDuel lineups. One final player to get to, that's Nikola Vucevic. The Magic Center is $9,800. That is the most expensive player that you're going with tonight. You're building your lineups around this star at the center spot. Why is Vooch your guy this evening? Well, at center tonight, we have the Joker, we have Embiid, but I like Vooch tonight. He's just a little bit cheaper. The matchup is slightly better going up against the Mavs, who are allowing 55.93 FanDuel points per game to opposing point guards. You know, for Philadelphia, uh, for Philadelphia their matchup, they, uh, the Pacers could be without Brogren tonight. So that could make their path a little bit easier. I think that the Magic will need more production from Vooch compared to Embiid, along with compared to Joker. So I think that on a point-per-dollar basis, we know he can match their production, and he's cheaper. He's coming with a 34.4% usage rate, producing 1.44 FanDuel points per minute. So I'll take a little bit of savings and go with Vooch. By going down to Vooch, who's under 10K, you're able to get some of these other stars that we talked about in there, Kyrie, Donovan Mitchell, uh, what have you. That that little bit of savings will be enough. Vooch is in a good spot, should provide the value that you need, and under $10,000 it's well worth tonight on this slate. That's going to do it for us here in the FanDuel. Hurry up, Tom. We appreciate the time. Good luck tonight. Same you. Have a good one. Absolutely. Tomorrow on the show, we'll be joined by Davis Maddock of Sports Grid as we go over his top choices for this week on the PGA Tour. For Tom Becky, I'm Greg Sussman. Thanks so much for watching. Enjoy the games tonight, and we'll see you back here tomorrow for another edition of the Fans Will Hurry Up.